Hey guys, a um, couple of things, just hopping on real quick. I had a couple of questions for my last live, so I'm going to address the question. Um, I was reminded I forgot to give you a piece of information about our setting spray versus our setting powder, so I'm going to do that. Um, and then real quick talk about a new product, Holy Moly Batman. So we just launched a new product hours ago. Hi Larry, hey Mike. Um, hours ago, literally, and it's 75% sold out of the stock that we originally had. Hey bud, 75%, um, it's, it's ridiculous. Um, but it's our lip plumper. It's brand new, it's plant-based, it's collagen derived. You can put it on at night, ladies, and it works all overnight and it plumps those lips up. And then you can put it on in the morning over top of whatever lips you normally wear. So I need to get that out there because I snagged a few, but I've already had customers contacting me, so those few are almost gone. Um, if you want it, I need to know sooner rather than later, and I'm going to put in an order tonight to try to snag a few more before they run out and go on back order. That being said, um, like I said, I was reminded that in my live earlier, I didn't touch on the differences between the setting powder and the setting spray. I'm going to do that in a minute. The second thing I want to touch on is our kudos for the month, <clears throat> which is our new Splash liquid lipstick colors. Now, the ones we currently have... Um, these are highly pigmented matte colors. So the ones we already have, some of the colors are not for everyone. They're super bold, highly pigmented. A little, little, little goes a long, long way. So I'm going to show you how versatile they can be. This is one of our originals. This is Sentimental. We're going to work with that today. Um, I'm all about the pink right now, you know, because I'm going for pink this month, y'all. Um, we had six new colors come out. We'll talk about this too in a minute. That's, you know, I got all that free makeup today. I'm playing with it now. Um, I'm going to start and put some lip, lip exfoliator on while we start working here. Especially when you use bolder colors. Um, those of us who are getting up there a little bit in age, ladies, especially, and in the summertime too, when you're out in the sun, I want to make sure you keep your lips exfoliated. It helps keep your lipstick where it's supposed to be and let it not run. So this is a sugar-based scrub. Ooh, ooh, there we go. That's our lip exfoliator. Put that on for a second. And drop it all the way around. You can leave it on for a little while. It's like sugar based, like I said, it's all natural. You can just eat it, it's delicious. And rub that on. And just wipe that off here. A couple of tricks for this new, the new splash colors that came out. We have neutrals and we have pinks. So really nice colors for summer. We've been asking for a long time for neutrals. Um, oh, stand by. Sorry, y'all. Trick number one. <laughs> I've exfoliated my lips. Trick number one, eye primer. So when you're using um, really colors that you want to pop, or colors that are paler especially too, um, you want to mute the natural color of your lips. So I've already exfoliated. We're going to take the eye primer and kind of mute our natural color of our lips a little bit to make those things that we put on it really pop. Now, that being said, like I said, the Splash Liquid Lipsticks, we released six new colors this month. Four of them are already in back order. Hey, Frida. Um, hey, Heather. So like I said, these women are crazy. The, the Limp Plumper that came out today, 77% gone already. Um, like I said, I snagged a handful. I've already had several people message me for it. So I'm hoping to snag a few more when I get off of here. Um, splash liquid lipstick. Women are crazy with this makeup. We've released six colors, four on back order. They're going to be back in stock in the next couple of weeks, but they just are selling so quickly. So the special for this month, the kudos is you buy three of the splash, any of the colors, the ones we already have are the six new ones. You get a free eyeliner, uh, lip liner to go with your splash liquid lipstick. So the primer's on, it's kind of done drying. I'm going to start with the sentimental. Um, with this, this applicator is really, really good. Normally, if I use a regular lipstick or a gloss, I line my lips first. This applicator is really good. So I'm just going to go ahead and use this to kind of fill in. We're still, like you see, Hot Mess Express from earlier. It's been crazy town a couple of days. But we're going to put the sentimental on, and then I'm going to show you how you can change your color. Oh, look, it almost matches my shirt. Huh. I don't know. 
what everyone else is doing tonight. But it's pouring here on the bay. Super dreary. Sage and I have had a pretty lazy day. I had a rock and migraine yesterday. It was miserable. I barely made it through church. And I spent the bulk of my Sunday on the couch. It's probably been 10 years since I had one that bad. It was miserable. So I'm still lagging a little bit today. Really not feeling my best. Hi, Aunt Debbie. Um, so there's the splash. Like I said, it's um, this is the one that came with my kit. It's a little bolder than I typically would wear. So like I said, I put the primer on, put the splash on. Now, one of the things you can do with your splash to change your color. Take your, conceal your concealer. I use Scarlet. I'm just going to put a little bit on the back of my hand. Like I said, we'll talk about this in a minute. <laughs> but I put the Scarlet um, concealer on the back of my hand. I have the splash on my lips. And I'm just taking my lip brush. A lot of people just use their um, applicator for their splash. That's totally fine too. I'm going to use my lip brush with my Scarlet. And you can do one of two things. You can put it in the middle. And blend it out a little bit for more of an ombre look. Or you can put it all over. And it mutes and really changes color of your splash liquid lipstick. And now it is a matte. The difference with this matte um, compared to others, super moisturizing, wears much longer than others that I've tried. Um, and there's things that you can do on top of that to make sure it lasts even longer. So your matte lipsticks, um, like I said, I put primer on first, that's gonna help tremendously. Once this kind of sets, I'm gonna do this a little prematurely, but I would let this set a little bit longer. And then I'm gonna take my face primer. It's clear, it has no color. And you would just take that and dab that across your lips. And when that dries, that's going to set your kisser for the whole day. You can go all kinds of ways with this one. You can, when this dries, like I said, it's matte. When it dries, if you prefer a glossy look, because sometimes with a regular lipstick, you can't get a lot of pigment. These are so highly pigmented. Hi, Lori. Um, that you can put these on, let them dry, and then throw one of our glosses on, on top of them. So the lip plumper that goes over top of whatever it is that you're wearing for your day is clear. It's not shimmery. There's no glitter in it. Um, it's the palest, palest of pinks in the tube, um, but it's not going to add a whole lot of color to your lips. So it's not going to really um, change what it is that you're doing with your lips. So we have our Loyal and our Lucrative Lip Gloss if you really want something sparkly. This is clear. It's shimmer. So once you get this set for the day, I keep one of these in my scrub pocket and my pants at work <laughs> and whatever lips I use. A lot of days I just do one of our lip liners and fill it in. I'll just carry the gloss with me. So that's the deal. That's one of our Splash lip Liquid Lipsticks. They're on special this month. You buy three. Like I said, we just released six new colors. Lots of nudes and pinks for summertime. They're beautiful. Um, buy three, you get the free lip liner. So that's the deal with that. Um, let's see what else. Oh, the question about me forgetting my last live. So, Setting powder, setting spray. Different products for different purposes. So the setting powder I use every day. I have really oily skin, no matter what kind of foundation I use, I always use the setting powder. They say that it's, um, it blurs. So it blurs your pores, it blurs your fine lines. Um, it's like your airbrush after your makeup's done. Um, so this is what it looks like. It's got a little screen, it's translucent. It does not have a color. So I just take my powder brush and I put it in there and I go all over with that. And I actually, especially when I'm um, working, because we're on our feet and we're moving all day, 
I glisten a little more than I care to glisten. So I'll take this in my bag and reapply that like midday. And that's, that's it, that's done. Now the setting spray, that's different. So the setting spray is, um, when you shake it up really well, the setting spray goes on in a mist. And it's like a, um, like a biopeptide blend that essentially creates a wall. It sets your makeup for the day, prevents that summertime melty face that I tend to get at work or when I'm outside at a barbecue or whatever because, like I said, I do have oily skin. Um, I'm just get priming my pump here. Eight to ten inches from your face, close your eyes. Um, real quick, a couple of sprays and done. It's got a really, really light smell. The other ones that I've tried, I couldn't use. The, the smell was chemically... When they set on my skin, it was sticky. This dries to where you can't even feel like it's there. It's one of the favorite things that I bought so far. I just got it the other day. We're in love, in love, in love with our setting spray. So anyway, I think I answered um, the questions that I had from my life earlier. Um, I know I forgot to touch on the differences between those. Um, we talked about our ways to change our color with our splash liquid lipsticks. Um, I'm going to post some pictures later. My girlfriends are even using these on their eyes. It's turning out beautifully because they're matte and they're so highly pigmented. You can just put them on the back of your hand and use them like eyeshadow as well. Now this, because it's not a hot mess express today, I was playing with my new splurge lip, my splurge um, eye colors today. I don't know if you can see how beautiful they are because the lighting here is so bad today. It's so dreary. But this is the spectrum now of my splurge cream shadows. And really, this lighting does not do them justice. These here in between my nails are so sparkly and so pretty, I can't stand it. Like, I can't wait to play with them on my eyes. Sage and I tried a couple of them today. Um, but they go all the way down to everydays. Like, these can work with palette, too, like, beautifully. And, you know, you've got your little more adventurous colors. But we're, we had... The blessing of free makeup. So we chose a bunch to try. Um, we're loving it so far. Thanks for checking in with me. Um, don't forget to find your why. Don't ever forget to find your why. Chase your why. Love your why. Let me know if I can help you with anything. Have a great night.